I remember my first track, my uncle let me do it. I wrote my first verse and he added to it. Had me sounding so good on the playback music even though I wasn't good. Knuckle up Rex, made recreations that was so fly. If the fan was the outstar, this lullaby. Star how we the next coming young stars in the bank tip. Made us rock that life. Made us talented from ship to lobster in the restaurant. Getting fruit for our labor. Resolved the madness of a fallen star. Made us transform like Optimus Prime. We are the stars. Regardless if you mention them or not. I'ma start out like I'm starting in. Then I'm credit out. President me or die. I'm a star even if the space is not my home and I don't shine, partner. Let's get it. Clap for me, clap for me. Let's go. Hey. <laughs> I love this shit. Hey. Let's go. What's happening? You tune in a little side right now. Let's get it. Yo, what's happening? It's your boy Lil Side Wilson here. You feel me? I'm 20 years old. I'm from Oakland, California, and welcome to my video. Yeah. I'll say my uncle, Knuckle Up Records, you feel me, Knuckle Up Rex, you feel me, Dave, my uncle, um, basically when I, when I was younger, you feel me, I was playing Mortal Kombat with my cousin and stuff, you know, we was playing and stuff, and he was whooping me, playing tellies and all, you feel me, dogging me, but my uncle was playing music downstairs in the basement, and I was out there. So let me go check that out. And I went there, and I'm listening to the beat, I'm like, hey, let's go. And he asked me, did I want to be on the song? And that point forward, I started writing the verse, or I, I started writing, as you say back then, I started writing. He switched words around, you know, and it was kind of confusing for me, but I got it in. And once he played it back, I was like, yo, that's some crazy shit. And, th and now this is my outlet, you know? Because I didn't have an outlet at first. So all thanks to my inspirations and to my uncle, you feel me? I love y'all. Yeah. I would say it had to be Andre 3000. The reason why it was Andre 3000 because he was very abstract. He was very poetic, you know? And I feel like that I had that side to me. And it's like, I was the abstract one out of everybody else who was just doing the mainstream music. And so like, that's one of my influences. This guy named Zaya Bingo, Tip, as we call him Tip. Um, you feel me? He was the one who really taught me how to do Pro Tools, Logic. He basically put me on the game that I needed to be on at the time. And so, like, he's not here right now. Um, he's actually handling some business out the way, but I wish that he was here so he could actually push me further. But that's actually what, what really inspired me to actually get into it, you know? So. Yeah. Hard struggle, let's get it. I remember my, my uncle let me do it. And he added to it, had me sounding so good on the playback music even though I wasn't good. Made recreations that was so fly. Star high, we the next coming young stars in the bait tip made us rock that life. In the restaurant getting fruit for our labor. Made us transform like Optimus Prime. We are the stars. Regardless if you mainstream or not. I'ma start out like I'm starting, then I'm credit out. I'ma start even if the space is not my home and I don't shine, partner. <laughs> Let's go. Clap for me. Clap for me. Clap for me. Hey. Came a long way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm gone. Hey, can I do a um can I do like the ad lib ad libs? Yeah. I wanna open up a door for people who feel like they are in the middle of a so-called sucker and a so-called so-called gangster. Cause in this in this life you either a gangster or a sucker. You know, and it's like I hate to actually have that label, so I put myself in the middle. I'm not a gangster or a sucker. I can be both, you know? But at the same time, it's, it's just the fact that me being me, accepting me who I am, and also, if you look on this mixtape, hold on. Let me get this for you one time. See this? Industrial swag, a piece of me, you feel me? It's double-sided, you know? A piece of me, you feel me? You can hit me up on the website, it dropped March 19th, but there's a song on here called Add to the Game. 
and basically add to the game is just to let y'all know who I am and, and, and let you know how I got my integrity and you know that I'm willing to stand by my integrity you know so it's like I want anybody to be able to be inside this rap game or this industry or this aristocracy as, as you say but I want them to feel like they can be themselves they don't have to act hard, they don't have to be hard, they don't have to be scared. You feel me? You just be yourself. So that's that's what I want to do. Me, me myself. So, yeah. I love this shit. Yeah! <laughs> Clap on me. Hey! 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 <laughs> Let's go. I love this shit. Yo. Oh, yeah. I love this shit. <laughs> this shit is hella fun to me, blood. You just don't know. Once you get in my shoes, you understand. Hey. <laughs> I love this shit. Hey. I'm gone.